If you're just with us, it's been a tremendous bit of hockey so far and more to come. We have begun the third period. Gains the zone and looks over his options. Sends to the point. Fires! Ring 10 bells for that save. Vancouver's got that win. Laid on to Vanek. Good quick poke check there. Edmonton's trying to work it hard along the boards. Passing one off now to Vanek. Let's it go. Oh, a save there. Wrist one. Save. Held there for a face-off coming up next. A little under six minutes have been played. The Oilers with an edge, three to one. Loose puck regathered by Hutton. Shoots one. Off the mark. Oh, that puck slowed up and just missed the side of the net. Edmonton's in control of the puck up the wing. Carries it up the side. And he steps in. Propelled to Vanek. He's got that pass at the point. Receives that pass from the other side. Robbery there. The Canucks leave their own end. On to Vanek. A shot. And the pickup. Wow, that's got to be a call. That's got to be a penalty. And that's got to be an answer from the other team. And so the fight begins. Now that's the sign of a true teammate. going back into old times for those two major penalties. Both these guys are going to get a well-deserved rest after that scrap. Vancouver penalty to number 14, a five-minute major for fighting. And the penalty to number 25, Darnell Murph, a five-minute major for fighting. Hutton's blocked so many pucks over the last couple of games, you would think you'd like to stick handle one of them once in a while. They win the draw. Now can they get it out? The Oilers up the wing are moving the puck. Shoots! That shot came from nowhere. A quick developing play right in front. Almost looks like he's too close to the goaltender. Save! The Canucks have to take a chance here. They pull their goalie. Loose puck. There was no getting through. Whistle blown. Play stopped. The referee will hand out a penalty does not get any more dramatic than this. Four feet by six, yawning open at one end, hoping for an advantage at the other. And the game is over. The Oilers have another win, and the streak continues. This team has been hot as of late. They are following their game plan. It's If you're just with us, it's been a tremendous bit of hockey so far, and more to come. We have begun the third period. 
Puck now possessed by Larson. Edmonton's got it and moving up the wing. Carries it to the corner. Right to the point. Back in his defensive end to get it. Puck covered, whistle blown. Vancouver's prevailed on another faceoff. Nice job holding the puck. Good stick down on the ice, so nothing good happening there. Hangs on to that one, and he'll see a faceoff right near him. Just a bit over four minutes play. The Oilers have the advantage in this one, four goals to two. Oh, and the pass wouldn't go. Save! Let's it go. And possession now on the pickup by Larson. Loose puck did not go well. Penalty call coming. Watch for his signal here. The Oilers get a two-minute penalty for tripping. Vancouver's power play gets another chance to operate. Hasn't been effective yet. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. Gathered in by Martinez. And he takes the heat off by clearing. Long way to go and not much time to do it. Flings it. No! I don't see too many guys getting away of blocking that shot. That thing had some heat on it. The Oilers are back even. Full strength action, the penalty kill. Dreisaitl's almost certainly going to try and make a difference now that he's back on the ice. I'm sure he's feeling a little bit of juice as his penalty killers bail him out. Trying to go to Phaneuf. He's got that pass off the wing and can move ahead. Shoots one. Blocked away. Takes that pass off the boards. Scooped up by Puglia. Puck is thrown to Sutter. Gets in. What'll he do? Shoots one. Say! Edmonton's got it back in their own zone. One into another. Abel Salzer's play with the puck is known throughout the league, but when he lays the body on, everybody wakes up. The Canucks have killed it all. The Branson's back on the ice, and the penalty has been killed, but, man, there's just no such thing as a good penalty when you're trying to climb back into the game. They've got to stay on the ice. Face off. Can they clear it? And that one sent back out. The Oilers were under so much pressure. That was the only play to get it out of the zone. Directing that one to Horvath. He gains the zone. Drill. Blocker away. Wow, that's got to be a call. That's got to And the end result of what's happened is this. The gloves are down. It's not about winning or losing the fight. It's about showing up. And he did in a big way. This was pretty predictable. These two players have been banging into each other most of the night. And at this point, this fight is about setting the tone for the rematch that is coming down the pipe. The game is over. Edmonton's got a win, and their winning streak keeps going. With that win, Doc, they found themselves with a tidy streak. In
If you're just with us, it's been a tremendous bit of hockey so far and more to come. We have begun the third period. Gains the zone. Around through the corner. With a shot. Taken over again. Slid the Hutton. Up the wing, driving on. Shot, terrific challenge, outstanding save. You don't get many better opportunities than that. Great save. Vancouver's got another win. Using the point, he's got it. And the loose puck gathered in by Vanek. Snaps a shot. Edmonton's finding its way to center ice. And possession seized by Cassian. Looks over his options from the corner. And angled to Kleschbaum. Good hand to eye and the reach of the stick. Wasn't intentional, didn't go well, loose puck. And this play is whistled down, it is offside. A little under three minutes have been played in this, the third period. Two goals have been scored, both by one team. Vancouver's in possession as they move up the wing. Puck loose, couldn't get through. Skating with it now in their own end. Dumped in. Vancouver's back to play in their own end as the clock ticks down on the power play. Marvelous save. A great chance was no chance. A good stick there, so no complete pass. Into the end of attack. Got it right back. Canucks with a face-off win. They'll have to go back and recoil thanks to this clear by Gagne. Knocked right off the stick. Looking for options in neutral ice. He gets it back. Vancouver's cleared. A lot of work, but penalty time less and less now. Corralled it again. Great chance, but it's off the iron. Drill. Star! What an impressive goal, shorthanded. Vancouver's goal has built an even bigger lead. We're in the third period. For the opposition, at least that is fortunate. The Oilers want to generate something up the wing. And he dumps it in. Full steam up the wing. That play went offside. Just under seven minutes to go in the third. Do you see a pattern developing here? They're up now by three. Laid on, Bahorva. Up to the point. Forcing attention in deep. Just couldn't find the target. There's not really much place to go with the shot. He's trying to be perfect. He misses, and the puck rings around the boards. Back to the point. Poke check. That one comes right on his stick. Not very long, but good. Gives it on a cross from the point. That's a great save. I was watching for sticks to go up. No celebration this time. Puck now possessed by Thomas Vanning. Sticked away. Has it in his own end. They've got it. Could not be filtered through a strong play by Larson. Good look, save! So final minute. Enough is enough. Try to clear the puck. The game is over. Edmonton's lost this game and they were blown out. But one thing they carry with them is a long winning streak. The sad news is...
If you're just with us, it's been a tremendous bit of hockey so far and more to come. Underway in the third period. We are as we started. Tied. Hammered. Oh, stick save. Scorch is one. Great save. You got to battle through a screenplay. He covers and holds on. The team has always leaned on him as one of their offensive producers. In the playoffs, you have to look to your best players to be your best. And here he is in the top ten. Defensive zone win. Oh, and he's hammered. Abel Salzer's never been shy. Stared him down and made the save. The pass is off the mark. What a chance that would have been. Up to the point. Slid to dry side. That shot hit a man. Nicely into the zone. Offside is called. Somebody got over anxious there. Talbot stretched out as far as he can go. He just got a chunk of that shot. from this close in. A little under six minutes have gone by. And so it is one to one. Quick work on the faceoff. Fires. Puck covered. Whistle blown. Nice faceoff work. Vancouver's in their own end moving the puck. Gets in. What'll he do? Puck's loose. Mishandled. Knocked right off the stick. Glides across. Gives it on a cross from the point. Sends it back the other way. Snaps it to Fanning. Sends it across the blue line. Off a of body. Brought on and the forwards can change on this dump in. Edmonton's carrying it in their own end. He's in on an onside play. Breaks, what a save. You want to score goals, you have to go to this area. It's almost like these teams are mirror images of each other. There's no room on the ice. Nobody has been able to spread out the play and generate a whole ton of scoring chances. Chooses the corner for this. Sends to the point. Takes a shot. Great glove save, and he keeps it. What a glove save. He showed him the glove, and he took it away. The Canucks with a face-off win. Trying hard to get it out of the zone. Possession taken up by Vanek. Up the wing, holding on to it well. Breakaway chance! The Oilers wheel one ahead up the wing. Got it at the point. Hangs on to that one, and he'll see a face-off right near it. The horn sounds an exciting finish to this game. The Canucks emerge from this one out of all the chaos with a win. It was the little things that got him this victory here tonight.
If you're just with us, it's been a tremendous bit of hockey so far and more to come. Carryover penalty time, so the penalty kill will continue on a fresh sheet of ice. Puck picked up here. That puck went loose off the enemy. Shoots one. He's got it, but has to get rid of it. That was a great job. Shot back down. More time off the clock. Loose puck, solid defensive play there. Vancouver's lugging it along in their own end. Gains the zone. Hammers one. Great save. Got some, not all. Edmonton's got a face-off win. Ryan Strom gets the puck, fifth overall in 2011. Side to side they go, save! Marches on a cross. Shoots, wonderful save. What skill by both goalie and shooter. Terrific stop from right in front of the net, but you've got to find a way to put the puck in the net. Tips it back. Pass across at the point. Puts one on. Score! Vancouver's broken the tie here in the third period. Let's see what happens before time expires. A little under seven minutes have gone by here in the third. The Canucks lead by a goal. They just broke the tie moments ago. Save! Gives it over to the point. What a strong wrist shot. He scores! Second of the game. What a performance. A face-off win. Let's see what develops. Gains the zone and looks over his options. Good intercept. Vancouver's moving the puck up the wing. Around through the corner. Takes a shot. And they've got it again. Slid to Tanev. In the slot, he's got it. Good quick poke check there. Edmonton's in control of the puck in their own end and readying an attack. Waits with it. Still no shot. Score! Three straight goals. They win the draw. Let's see if it pays off. Points it. Propelled by Horvath. Has it back deep. Attack zone possession here. Pass comes to him from the crease. And he steps across the line. The Canucks have gotten to center ice. Gets in, looks over his options here. He takes that one right ahead. Good pass. Nearing the last minute of the third period.
If you're just with us, it's been a tremendous bit of hockey so far, and more to come. Penalty kill will continue at the start of this period, though there's not a lot of time to kill off. Shoots. Good chance. Denied. Outstanding save by the goalie. Pitch to Vanek. Poked away. Passing one off now to Horvath. The Canucks needed something from their power play and didn't get it. They just can't take any more. Off his glove. Able to attack now. The Oilers looking to head man up the wing. Chooses the corner for this. That one is pointed to him. That shot hit a man. Taken and held at the blue line. Edmonton's continuing to probe up the wing. Can he generate something from there? Good hand to eye. And the reach of the stick. Sticked away. Vancouver's accelerating ahead through the neutral zone. A shot. Another solid pad save. Freezes play. Just under seven minutes have passed here in the third. The Canucks are ahead two to nothing. Vancouver's got that face-off win. Shoots one. Broke it right up. Right near the line. Can he keep it going? They score! Three straight goals. Vancouver's goal has built an even bigger lead. We're in the third period. For the opposition, at least that is fortunate. Looking to Lucic. Pitching it to Dreisaitl. Let's it fly. Snapped out of the air. The Canucks with a face-off win. Carried to the corner by Lucic. Oh, great cut. Up the wing still with possession and with hope. Snaps on a wrist shot. Oh, and he missed the net. He was trying to be a little bit too fine there. That's why he missed the net. Solid clean win. Try to clear the puck. And he's hammered. Abel Charles has never been shy about staying in the guts of the game. He's a skilled player but he's not afraid to throw his body around. Takes that pass at the point of drive. Fires, not on the net. He had enough room to unload. Oh, what a hit. And we've got a man hurt here and probably something more to happen after. The first concern is the injured player, Doc, but somebody has to respond. and got a fistful, five each for fighting. Both these guys are going to get a well-deserved rest after that scrap. Final minute of the third. There will be a lot of joy in one locker room and some real searching in the end. The Canucks with a clean win on the draw. Up the wing, skating with it now. Moved along and in. Perfect centering pass. Score! And that's four straight goals. And they've won the faceoff. Brought ahead and a carom dump to the corner. Hawks loose. The roadblock got in the way. Big hit. Possession gone. Not very often you see a big hit like that in open ice. On the Horvath. Got his glove on it. Another save. These saves are all about positioning. What a shot. 
save. This is overwhelming. Looking for room. Pressure mounting here. Outstanding save with the glove. Oh, he thought he had him on the glove side. Final seconds away from the second big celebration they will have had this playoff year. They are halfway to the Stanley Cup. And the game is over. The series is over. They've won the series and they'll move on.